Hi, Katie McIntyre, sports venue business founder and CEO. Just wanted to bring you an update about last week's ESMA Summit, which took place at Parc OL in Lyon, France. Um, it was a jam-packed three days. Uh, started off on day one with the stadium development seminar, uh, during which we hold, heard on a whole variety of stadium development projects, including the Cantrida Stadium in Croatia, uh, the latest on Feyenoord Stadium, um, and then we also heard about a range of stadium projects coming up in Italy um, from heads of the Futura League, who were actually will be bringing you an interview with in the next couple of weeks, so keep a lookout for that. On day two, we then heard from ESMA president, John Beattie, um, as well as from um, Olympic Lyonnais president, Jean-Michel Olay. Um, and we also heard from ESMA Managing Director Dimitri Hugan, who gave uh, members an overview of the association, past, present and future. Other speakers on the day included Andreas Shah, uh, Head of Venue Operations for UEFA, and Patrick Talty, uh, the General Manager at US Bank Stadium, which was confirmed as one of the venues that ESMA members will visit during the USA tour uh, later on in the year. Uh, on the final day, that was uh, the in-depth workshops, so they covered fan entertainment, stadium management, safety and security management, and pitch management, um, and featured a vast range um, of industry experts, from Keith Kent, um, who many of you will know is head groundsman at Twickenham, um, and Martin Murphy, who's the stadium director at Aviva Stadium, uh, who was a very happy man by the end of the summit, as Aviva Stadium was named as the uh, host for the ESMA Summit 2018. Um, so we're going to be bringing you a feature later next week, bringing you all the details from the event, from the best practices that were discussed, to the hot topics, to the project details, and obviously punctuate all the key takeaways from the event. Uh, what I should say, if you were an attendee and would like to make a comment, um, just contact me. You can find all my contact details on the website, sportsvenuebusiness.com, and I'll make sure to include them in the feature. That's all for now. Keep tuned.